everyone, I'm Sarah and this is Budget Sew, so, where we create stylish, fashionable looks as inexpensively as possible. Today, I'm going to show you my fabric haul from Fabricville Online. If you like this video, please subscribe to Budget Sew so, and follow me on social media at Budget Sew. So. Just a quick note before we get started, today I'm wearing Simplicity 2648. The link to the video with that dress is right here at the top of the screen. I was chatting on the phone with my mom the other day and I mentioned that I wanted to buy some fabric, but my usual online fabric stores didn't have quite what I was looking for. She sent me a link and said, what about Fabricville? Originally, I thought that Fabricville was only in Quebec and would only ship within that province, but I was wrong. They ship across Canada and even to the States. I clicked on the link that my mom sent me and I was thrilled. Across the top of the screen was a banner showing that Fabricville was having a sale. Buy one meter, get two meters free on a huge selection of fashion fabrics. So I started loading up my online cart. The first fabric is this polka dot printed polyester in Dark Midnight that I bought for $5 a meter. It's a navy blue fabric with a random pattern of white dots. The fabric is 58 inches or 147 centimeters wide and I bought 6 meters. It feels lightweight and breezy but the description indicated that it's a medium weight polyester. The first pattern that I chose for this fabric is Berta 3527 from March 1996. I think it's March 1996 because on the back of the pattern above the Berta logo it shows 196 over 3 or 196 over 3. My mom bought this pattern for me at Luke and Optimus Thrift Store for 25 cents. This dress in two lengths has a button front and an option of sleeveless or short sleeves. This is one of those new Berta sewing patterns, new at the time, that has the seams and hem allowances included. The shorter version of the dress, views A and B require eight buttons, and the longer version, view C, needs nine. The finished back length of the dress for views A and B is 39 and 3 quarters to 41 inches, and view C is 48 to 49 and a quarter inches. The width of the lower edge of views A and B is 83 and 3 quarters to 91 and 3 quarter inches, and view C is 104 and 3 quarters to 112 and a half inches. Although the pattern recommends rayon, crepe, and silk, this polyester will be perfect for the dress. It'll be flowy and breezy and light. Since I have six meters of fabric, I have plenty left over for a couple more projects. I'm going to make the pants of New Look 6203, View I. New Look 6203 is a pattern for Mrs. Evening Separates, including tops, tunics, skirts, and pants. These Evening Separates have Asian flair. The top and tunic have a mandarin collar and side angled neck opening. The mandarin collar is a small close-fitting stand-up collar, usually about 3 or 4 centimeters high, with edges that don't quite meet at the center front. Some of the tops and tunics have frog fasteners, which are fabric closures usually from ornamental braiding, and consist of a button and a loop which fasten at the front of the garment. The pants and bias cut skirt have an elastic waist. My mom bought this pattern for me in the same pattern haul as Berta 3527 from Lucan Optimus Thrift Store for 25 cents. The link to the video with those patterns is right here at the top of the screen. This tunic pattern reminds me of a similar pattern that I made up 15 years ago. I used a deep red fabric with gold designs and black frog closures. I love the tunic so much that the fabric began to disintegrate, so I cut off the frog closures to be used on another garment. You may remember these pants from my new look 6203 sew along. The link to the video with new look 6203 is right here at the top of the screen. The next pattern is S1055 
the Donna Top from My Image. This is a downloadable digital PDF pattern that was free with the purchase of the My Image magazine, issue 18 from spring summer 2019. Digital patterns are not included in the magazine, but may be printed off the Made by Oranges website for free. To download the pattern, first visit madebyoranges.com and then go to PDF slash books. Then use the code included in the issue to order and download the pattern. Finally, print out the pattern and lay it out and tape it together. A detailed instruction guide is included with the download. This loose fitting top has a crew neckline and tulip sleeves. The recommended fabrics are viscose, viscose polyester, and viscose elastin, so it can be made with either a woven or a knit fabric. The finished back length is about 65 centimeters. And just before I move on to the next fabric, I'll open this up. The next fabric is this Dahlia Solid Polyester in Navy Blue. This fabric is 58 inches or 147 centimeters wide, and I bought nine meters, three for me and six for my mom. This fabric was part of the buy one, get two meters free sale. The original price of this fabric was $152.91, but I paid $51.99, so I saved $100.92. It's a medium weight polyester and machine washable. The pattern that I chose for this fabric is Vogue 1233, a Pamela Rowland Vogue Patterns American Designer pattern from 2011 that I bought when it first came out on sale at Fabricland. This close fitting line dress has front darts, princess seams, patch pockets with flaps, cap sleeves, a large turned back collar with extensions, a partially concealed button closure, and is mid-knee length. And the belt has a covered buckle. The finished back length of the dress from the base of the neck is 38 and a half to 40 and a quarter inches or 98 to 102 centimeters. So I'm gonna lengthen it just a bit. The lower edge width is 59 to 70 and a half inches or 150 to 179 centimeters. So it will be super comfortable for me. I may switch out the cap sleeves to short sleeves or maybe long sleeves. I love the large turned back collar on this dress and I think that gold buttons will really pop on the navy blue fabric. The next fabric is this printed bathing suit with SPF 50 in leaves blue slash green. Even though the description is bathing suit, this is not a knit fabric. It's 100% woven polyester and is lightweight and airy. It's also machine washable. The fabric is 58 inches or 147 centimeters wide and four meters long. The fabric was $21.99 a meter, but I paid $7.33 a meter. I originally thought this fabric was a knit, and I bought enough to make my favorite vintage Simplicity Jiffy Knit dress, but when the fabric arrived, it was a woven. If Fabricville doesn't say that the fabric is a knit, then it's definitely a woven. I still love this fabric, and I chose a lovely dress pattern for it. I chose Simplicity 1800 from 2012. It's an amazing fit collection pattern that I bought from Value Village. It has an open neckline that is feminine and flattering for all figure types. It has princess seams that follow the contour of the bust smoothly and allow for fit adjustments. It has a pleated skirt with just the right fullness and pockets concealed in the shaped seams. It has two lengths and three different sleeve options. Sleeveless with a tie neckline, cap sleeves, and a short sleeve option. It also has individual pattern pieces for slim, average, and curvy fit. And for B, C, D cup sizes for misses, and C, D, and double D cup sizes for women's. 
I'm going to make the longer version and I may alter the front bodice to narrow the open neckline slightly so that my bra straps won't show. Or I may alter the tie straps so that they'll go over the shoulders and attach at the back bodice. Since Simplicity 1800 uses about 2.5 meters of fabric, there's enough fabric left over for another project. I'm going to make M2254 from my image number 25, Fall Winter 2022-2023. So it's this one here. This pullover blouse has a raised waist with gathers and long sleeves into elasticized cuffs. The recommended fabrics are viscose polyester and viscose, so this fabric is perfect. This pattern is quite similar to Simplicity 9611, which I was thinking of buying on my last Simplicity.com pattern haul, but I like that M2256 has long sleeves. And I'm gonna open this fabric up for you as well so you can see how beautiful it is. The next fabric is this Dahlia Solid Polyester in French Blue. The fabric is 58 inches or 147 centimeters wide and I bought 3 meters. This fabric was part of the buy 1 meter get 2 meters for free sale. The original price of this fabric was $50.97 but I paid $17.33, a savings of $33.64. It's a medium weight polyester and machine washable. I'm going to make New Look 6567 from 2011. This princess seam dress has long or short sleeves, a semi fitted bodice, a back zipper, and four different necklines sweetheart, notched, square, and scoop. This dress pattern was a Christmas present, and I love it. The next fabric is this printed bathing suit with SPF 50 in leaves green. This is the same fabric as the blue and green leaves, but just a different color. It's a woven polyester and lightweight and breezy and also machine washable. This fabric is 58 inches or 147 centimeters wide and four meters long. The fabric was $21.99 a meter, but I paid $7.33 a meter. I'm going to make dress 4C from the fourth issue of 2023 of Berta Easy. V necklines elongate the neck and flatter any figure. This dress has an empire waistline and the top piece looks wrapped. It has puffy raglan sleeves and a flared skirt. The extra wide ruffle at the hem turns a midi dress into a charmingly light maxi dress. The recommended fabrics are lightweight dress fabrics, so this green leaf fabric is going to be wonderful as this dress. There's some other wonderful summer dress patterns in this issue, so I was really pleased with Birdie Easy. Since dress 4C uses 3.4 meters of fabric, I might be able to squeeze out another project. I'm also going to make M1833, a top from my image special edition number one from 2018. This loose fitting top has three quarter length sleeves and a round neckline. The back length is about 65 centimeters and the recommended fabrics are viscose and viscose polyester. I think that the fabric chosen by my image is quite similar to my leaf fabric. The next fabric is this Dahlia Solid Polyester in Dark Teal. This is the same brand of fabric as the navy blue and French blue polyester. This fabric is 58 inches or 147 centimeters wide and I bought 6 meters. This fabric was part of the buy one get 2 meters free sale. The original price of this fabric was $101.94, but I paid $34.66, so I saved $67.28. It's a medium weight polyester and is machine washable. It also has a shiny side and a matte side. 
The first pattern I chose is Butterick 6655. This fitted dress with or without a sash has a lapped back zipper and mock button front with body darts, top stitching detail, and length and sleeve variations. For the sleeveless version, bias tape is required for the armholes. My favorite version is the longer dress and sleeves. Even though this pattern suggested cotton blends, linen, rayon, crepe, and lightweight denim, this polyester will look fabulous. Plus, I love the mock button front. I'll have to shop for some pretty buttons for it. I'm also going to make New Look 6708 from 2011. This top has long or short raglan sleeves with gathering at the shoulders and elastic cuffs and a button closure at the back neck. The finish length is 21 and a half to 23 inches. Now the total ease on this pattern is seven and a half inches. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna make it up in my usual size 16 or go down to a size 14. Next I chose Simplicity 9755 from 2023. This stylish front button crop top has straps and princess seams at the front and back. The skirt, pants and shorts have center front seams and fly front zipper closures. The pants and shorts include a belt with button detail and back patch pockets. The suggested fabrics are chambray, cotton blends, denim, lightweight denim, lightweight twill, and linen blends. Since I'm short-waisted, these low-rise pants will sit right at my waistline and the crop top will make a perfect vest. I'm going to open up the dark teal fabric so you can see it a bit better. So it has a bit of a sheen on this side and the other side is more matte. The next fabric is this Dahlia Solid Polyester in Moroccan Blue. Now this is the same brand of fabric as the dark teal polyester I just showed you. This fabric is 58 centimeters or 58 inches, sorry, or 147 centimeters wide, and I bought six meters. This fabric was part of the buy one meter get two meters for free sale. The original price of this fabric was $101.94, but I paid $34.66, so I saved $67.28. It's a medium weight polyester and machine washable. It also has a sheen to the, on the one side and it's quite matte on the other. The first pattern that I'm going to make is New Look 6707. New Look 6707 is an easy to sew pattern that was published in 2021. This blouse pattern has a v-neck and may be made with or without a large collar with ruffled trim. It has short sleeves that are gathered into a cuff or gathered into a ruffled cuff with elastic. The finished back length of this top is 20 and a quarter to 21 and three quarter inches. And the recommended fabrics are chambray, cotton lawn, cotton blends, crepe de chine, dotted Swiss, gingham, linen blends, poplins, and shirtings. This pattern is so pretty and feminine, and I love the large collar. I'm going to pair it with the pants from Vogue 1870 from 2022. The semi-fitted high-rise pants have flared legs, stitched front crease, fly zipper, contour waistband with a hook and bar closure. The pattern also includes a semi-fitted lined below hip length jacket with notch collar, shoulder pads, princess seams, flaps, welt pockets, and long two-piece sleeves with non-working vent and button trim. The suggested fabrics are wool blends, linen blends, gabardine, and jacquard, but this polyester will work well. I've moved away from skinny and slim fit pants and into wide leg and flared leg pants. The design of these pants is just so sharp. I'm also going to make New Look 6299. This beautiful dress can be made with a variety of options to fit your personal style. 
The dress has the option of contrast collar, contrast sides, and contrast sleeves in multiple lengths. The flared skirt comes in two fullnesses with views B and C with front and back godets. What I like about this pattern is that the princess seams go all the way to the shoulder seam. So if I sewed this dress together in a different order than the instructions, then it would make the dress more adjustable. Threads Magazine recommended sewing the front pieces to the back pieces at the shoulder seams first. Then it's much easier to take in or let out the dress. I'm going to open up this fabric so you can see the sheen on it. I want to show you the, the shiny side and the matte side. So you can see here there's a bit of a sheen on this side, whereas this side is quite matte. The next fabric is this Dahlia Solid Polyester in Maroon. This is the same brand of fabric as the Dark Teal, Moroccan Blue, Navy Blue, and French Blue Polyester. This fabric is 58 inches or 147 centimeters wide and I bought 9 meters three for me and six for my mom. The original price of this fabric was $152.91, but I paid $51.99, so I saved $100.92. It's a medium weight polyester and machine washable. It also has the same uh, sheen on one side and a matte finish on the other. I chose Quick Sew 4132 for this fabric. These dresses have a close fitting bodice with side front seams, a semi fitted skirt, side front and back seams, and a back zipper. View A has below elbow sleeves and a longer skirt, and view B has bias self lined sleeves and above the knee skirt. The finish length at the center back from the waist for view A is 23.5 to 25.5 inches or 60.3 to 65.3 centimeters. And the finish length at the center back seam from the waist for view B is 21 and a half inches to 23 and a half inches or 55.3 to 60.3 centimeters. I'm going to make view A with below elbow sleeves in the longer skirt, but I'm gonna lengthen it by a few inches. The final fabric is this crepe knit Nadine Paisley Burgundy fabric. It was not included in the sale, so it was $16.99 a meter. It's 59 inches or 150 centimeters wide and two meters long. It's 96% polyester and 4% lycra, and it feels fantastic. And it's also machine washable. This medium weight knit fabric is very soft has a brushed hand, and stretch for comfort and ease. This fabric is for my mom to go with the maroon and navy fabrics from this fabric haul. And I'll open it up so you can see it a bit better because it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a perfect match for the maroon and navy. I hope you enjoyed my Fabricville fabric haul. Subscribe to Budget Sew for more great videos. Thanks for watching. See you next time.